Yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up? Na, 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 na. Ski, 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 ski. You know what it is. Doing uh, a ZBZ, so you don't see this often. And it is Hydra and Brother. Obviously, uh, Hydra, really, really strong player. And then, obviously, Brother is really, really good. So... Probably both going to go for a choke, and these this is random versus random. Casting this on Friday, so probably get posted next week, maybe on a Wednesday, or Thursday, or Friday, depending on if I finish up that Def Jam series. So, basically mirroring each other exactly. Let's see who's got the faster. Looks like Brother has the faster pool, and both Overlords basically doing the exact same thing. We'll see these hatcheries come down. Gonna see each other. So now, and Hydra gonna cancel the choke hatchery. These are the things you see Hydra do that just makes him... I guess, if I think about it though, he would have had a quicker... This would have finished up, so... Might have been better off to keep that hatchery. Looks like he's going to make a creep colony right here. But here's your zerglings coming out. We got six zerglings. Going to go with a quick gas for brother. And I always mess up his name. I don't know if it's Gus or Huss. I want to say it's Huss. And maybe he doesn't know he's up against Zerg. So should be able to see that uh, overlord right here. And I don't think he knows he is up against a Zerg right now. So we will see. He's going all over the place. Let's see if he gets that lair or if he goes, uh, I would maybe just go into quick hydros den. Be kind of interesting. If I saw I was up against a Zerg, we'll see if he goes to that lair right now. There's your Overlord. He should be able to spot that out now. So, going to go top right. Hydra's got four. Going to have his fifth hatchery. Two Zerglings right here. Make sure... Okay. So, going to scout this out. Whoops. Take out one drone. Maybe two. So, doing a pretty nice job right there. 13 drones to 20. But the difference is, obviously, Hydra has a bunch more hatcheries. He also has no gas. So, we're going to see tech and Overlord going to scout this out. You guys like my channel subscribe if you want to not forcing you guys to um gonna see that lair and here is your spire see if he goes with the one more gas i think he needs to get one more gas right now zergling's gonna run in here and do some damage so 27, 21 on the drones. Gonna try to take out the spire. Gonna stack attack. And that's gonna make brother have to stack attack. Let's see if he's got some zerglings on the way. Gonna take out one drone. Nice little micro from Hydra. Take out two drones, three drones, four drones. He's so gonna get one more. Five drones. Almost gonna get that last drone. I think he meant to get it and then click away, but it didn't happen. So now 28, 23. Here's your Hydralis Den, and probably going to put down two, maybe even three gas. We'll see if he goes three gas. I think he might get one more. There's your Chamber, double Hydralis Den. Spire getting close to being done here. Going to get a couple spores around his main, which I think is a smart move. I've been doing a lot of SCW games. I 
There's this one guy on SCW. I don't know who he is, but he seems like he's pretty good. He's in first place right now. Let me take a look. His name is QLLQ. And he's 23 and 6. So I might do a couple games of him. Could be maybe someone like Jose. Here's your Mutas right here. Going to take out the Overlord. A couple more hatcheries going to come down for Hydra. And brother doing a pretty nice job here getting more hatcheries. Might even get another hatchery. ZVZ is hard. Let's see if he is he scouting for overlords, maybe? ZVZ has always been tough for me. So I never really my strategy for this is I just really just watch what other players do. Um, so Commentating on this is not my forte, not my strong point. But, um, here's your lair. TVT, I've seen enough TVTs to to be decent at, at knowing what to do for a TVT. But, yeah, ZBZ, I don't know. I usually find that the player that goes Hydra's does better. But, um... I do see players like Gensei will go for a bunch of Mutas with Zerglings. And those absolutely destroy Hydras. So, let's take out a drone. Two drones. Let me get some shots off on this Overlord. I'm trying to kill that Overlord. I don't know if it's worth it though. So, he's going to get that scout off. But you're going to see all those spores. And let's see if upgrades are on the way. There's your first upgrade. Four Hydra. Spire. Probably a Queen's Nest up here. There's your Queen's Nest. There's your Hive on the way for Brother. Already almost done. So we'll see if he goes into Guardians. Might make these guys into Guardians. Two more hatcheries. Both these guys play, spending their money pretty good. Brother spending his money. I mean, on point. Let's see if we got another Spire Hydra's done and a chamber. Getting two more gas. Hydra already has all of his gas right now, for the most part. That's the biggest thing in Zerg is trying to get all your gas. And a big thing is Defiler play. See if Hydra gets another lair. Just in case he does lose his main. That's why you want to get this hatchery back here. In case you do lose your main to Mutabomb. So it's going to be 8 hatcheries. And Hydra, look at his gas. He's got 3k. Oh, he's got pretty good gas as well. So, looks like he just made a bunch of Mutas. He's got 11 on the way. Some Lurker upgrade getting made. Hydra's going to come on out. And he might burrow these guys on the side. We'll see if he's getting burrow upgrade. Or if he has it already. And sometimes you want to try to get that Nidus Canal. You can sneak in a Nidus Canal. Here's your Choke Hatchery for Hydra. 142 supply. Here's your Mutas that are going to spawn. I'm going to take out these Mutas. So I'd like to see Brother get about six more hatcheries. He's going to need them. Here's your Defiler Mound. We'll see if Overlord Speed gets made pretty soon. I want to try to get that Overlord Speed as soon as possible. Here's your Muta's going to go Scout slash Hunt. And he's got two rows of Muta's. Might take out this Overlord while he's here. Might send in one Muta just to see what's going on. There's your Mutas right here. Gonna micro these guys out of here. And he's got more Muta, so we're gonna see some Muta on Muta action. There's your Defiler Mound. No upgrades yet. No upgrades yet. More Mutas. Here's your Queen. So you use the, I want to say it's Ensere, the green stuff. So 
So we'll see if he goes for the main Filer Mound. We'll see if a Nidus Canal comes down. Going to get a couple Creep Counties. I do think Brother needs to get some more hatcheries, though. Sending these guys on out. Here comes your Mutas. And when you go for an attack like this, and you're sending out all your Mutas like this, you do want to have a bunch of spores around your main just in case you get muta bombed as well. That's why he's got a bunch of queens here as well. Look at all these guys. Is he going to wait for that upgrade to finish? Let's see how close it is. Almost done. Going to go for it. It'll upgrade when he gets there. And going to go straight for the main. And here goes the main. Can't click it. And it's not going to go down. So, And here is your attack from Brother. He's got no upgrades. Let's see if some more mutas. Yeah, a bunch more. He's got 28 mutas on the way. Got the overlords over. Try to put those over the main so it's hard to click on the main. But someone did show me that. Oh, he's going to. Nice job right there. Slow this down. Another job right here. going to slow this down. So that really hurts. Nice. That basically eliminates him losing his main. But yeah, someone told me that you can just click the main. You don't need if it's covered up. So, gonna make these guys into guardians and maybe devourers. He needs to get a little bit more gas here. There's a hatchery. Overlord gonna spot this out. Did he cancel? That's a lot of guardians. So, here's your devourers right here. Gonna send these guys on over. Devourers right here. A big battle. One one upgrades. One one upgrades. This is why I like to do ZVZ because this is this is fun stuff. More mutas coming in here. Got a nice swarm right there. That's huge. And plague gonna come down. So these guys are gonna get smoked by mutas. Watch these guys just take these guys out so quickly. Choo -choo -choo -choo. More plague. Great job there by Hydra. Got these guys under the swarm. It's about 14 minutes into this one. Let's see what the upgrades are. 2-2 two, two on the ground. Other hatchery coming down. Let's see what the vision is. This is the vision for Hydra. This is the vision for Brother. So both players, I mean, Hydra's going to have to get an expo for gas. I mean, both players really using up all their gas. I'd say this is pretty dead even. Uh, Brother doing a pretty good job here. So, Hydra defending. Lurker's on the way. They'll probably put down... See if he plagues this or if he swarms, puts on another swarm. So Muta on Muta action. These guys are running on up. Might take out these defilers right here. Defiler mounds. Could maybe go for the main? Can he get the main? Nice little sneak. Oh, he's misclicking it. He's getting some shots up on the main. Gonna take it down. 17 so he got about a thousand damage on this main 900 so nicely done Here comes some mutas See if I see a Nidus Canal. There's your Nidus Canal. So let's see if he tries to sneak one in over here. There's no sunken. Sometimes you just want to put a sunken at the side of your, side of your base. So if someone does put a Nidus Canal there, your sunken will attack it. So here's your Overlord. I think he's gonna try to Nidus right here. 
Muta coming in. He's acting like he's... Well, there's too many Hydras over here. Yeah, so he wants to get this in here. There's Zerglings right here, so I don't know if this is going to work. I don't see a Sunken, though. And no Nidus Canal. Now Hydra at 12k, 3k. Let's see what the upgrades are. 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two. Oh, he's got only got 0-1 on his ground upgrades. So, Brother needs to get those upgrades a lot better. For his ground units, looks like he's going to go for the attack. We'll see if Hydra starts building in the middle. Some sunkens right here. Sending out some more units. I mean, he can maybe get a Nidus Canal in right here. Here's your attack. And these upgrades are just huge, just dominating. Once he has three, three, three. There's your burrow. Once he has 3 3 on his upgrades, to stop these guys. That is not going to be good for Brother. Might see some Ultras. Let's see if he's getting. Let's see if he gets speed for his Ultras. Some more Mutas right here. Going to get plagued. I don't even know. Was there a Defiler chilling right here? These guys are going to go down real quick. And now Hydra might go for the main right now. I might send all these guys on over. Go straight for the main. And one thing that Brother needs to start doing is getting those queens like Hydra's been doing. And I'd like to see maybe like, yeah, two more hatcheries from Hydra. Here's your drones. Looks like he's going to build a bunch of hatcheries in the middle. Okay. So. And then he can just easily and quickly attack. He might even just put these lurkers back here. Defend. Here's your attack. And he use these guys to kind of tank. Yuta's coming in. Gonna take out the Nidus Canal. Running these guys through. It's at 1192. Gonna get under a thousand. So 626. So I mean. Get a whole nother thing of. So he puts that swarm up right away. Can he consume this lurker? That is a good question. Can you consume? He's gonna spot this out. I'm gonna try to split these guys up. Can you consume your opponent's lurker like that? He saw it just chilling here. So here comes your main attack. Got the mutas right here. Plague, gonna come down. It's gonna be close. You might get the main. Maybe not. Those guys went down so fast. And just that slowness really kills those mutas. And now Hydra can go straight for the main attack. 20 minutes into this game. Got some Hydras doing some, some work up here. This guy's eventually gonna go down with the Overlord. Some more plague. See if he just flies these guys right over the top. And they should have that three upgrade, yeah, three three. So this is gonna go down for sure. There's not really much that's gonna defend this. I'm trying to get that spire. I think he did, but I was there. There goes your main. We'll see if he goes after this right here. And take out the the spires. Nicely done. So smart move. And get that defiler mount as well. Maybe even go up the hydro this time. Gonna get that first one, get that other one, and now he knows. Basically, if he can get this Hydra then I don't know if he sees it. His mutas are actually just crushing it. 
So yeah, gonna take out that Hydro Stun right here. And... So he plagues this, maybe? Some Hydras are gonna spawn right here. And now he can just kind of just... Maybe even make some Ultras in here. Lurker's coming in. The Swarm gonna come down. Take all this out. These guys can't do anything to these guys. Hydra's coming in. Here's your ultras. Love seeing ultras. Those guys are gonna feast. Plague gonna come down. Man, Hydra is so darn good. Just, he just takes his time. Gonna run these guys. Go after the minerals. Is he gonna be able to get that? Where's that? Get that swarm off. This guy's running around. Oh, he does get the swarm off. Trying to get this guy over there. Get those ultras in there, I guess. All right. These ultras are just taking over. Surprised he's not using, put a, a Nidus Canal here. Look at all these Ultras, little Arnolds here. Not little. Looks like they almost upgraded the. There's your lurkers down here, taking out all the drones. Take out the pool. Probably take out the hydro stun. Just watch how quickly that goes down. And yeah, that's gonna be your game. He's going to try to get the choke. Plague coming down. Going to go on the offensive here, so it's not over yet. Ultra's coming in. They're going to slice and dice these guys. There's your GG McGee. So, Hydra. Going to win that one. Nicely done. Showing you... I mean, he's... I don't know how he's gotten so good at ZVZ and TVT because no one really plays it that much, but he's always been a beast at ZVZ and TVT. I think I've only seen him lose a TVT once. He's beaten all the good players with his TVT, and I think I've seen him lose a ZVZ against a rabbit maybe. So good game. Just going to do the one game. Give it a like, subscribe, and uh, that was some fun stuff. I will talk to you guys later. Pete to the sis.